Uh, Apple threw his meal under the table, didn't he? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> well, tell us the story. Yeah. I would tell him when I was riding a bicycle. Oh yeah. I lived down on York Street, and we and uh, we were both in junior high, and uh, one walking to school, a uh, kid that was in school with me at, at Brookside, that was the grade school before we got to, see, to junior high, mm -hmm. because we had eight grades in the in the grade school mm -hmm. when you lived outside of the borough. Mm -hmm. And then when you got to ninth grade, then you had to go in to the junior high, which is a yellow building down in here. At that time, is where we went to school. Mm -hmm. So, Paul Kitzmiller had this maroon colored bicycle. And somebody stole it. <laughs> we were walking to school. I'm along with some other girls, and I said, Oh, he came along with this maroon colored bicycle. And I said, Look, there's Claude Kitzmiller's bicycle. And he said, The hell, it's Claude Kitzmiller's bicycle. And he said, It's mine. <laughs> wow, I backed up with that. <laughs> And that was the first. That was the that first, was first I ever saw Cupid him. Cupid struck. And then the Never second saw time, him somebody, got, somebody got hit by a car down on York Street, and I come up from down below York Street. <laughs> she was standing there, and I said, what happened? She started telling us, hell, it don't look like that to me, and then I left. <laughs> <laughs> he was <wasn't> very nice. <laughs> <laughs> so then the next time, she was babysitting, and Gladys Zimmerman was going with Jess Grog, and her and Jess said to me, you want a blind date? I said, yeah, hell, I'm game. I said, okay. okay. <laughs> so we went out on your Gladys street. told Huh? Gladys told Cleo and Lillian that she fixed you guys up. Yeah. yeah. That's right. Uh-huh. And I she thought they were wrong. No. I thought she just said that. No, yeah. no, no. So we went I down on the York Street. And they brought him down to where I was And there was Stacia. And I thought, well, she looks pretty nice. <laughs> she had a tight sweater and everything. Hmm. Yeah. Tight sweater? <laughs> yeah, and then what happened? How'd you make your move? <laughs> oh, then I started going with her and we'd go. Wait, where'd you meet? I mean, where did the girl set you up? Oh, the next time I took her to the movies, and after the movies I said, you want something to eat? She said, yes, yeah. so we went to the Quick Lunch. The Quick Lunch is where Baker's clothing store is now. It was a, a, it was a hot dog, dog, a hot, a hot dog mm -hmm. stand. They made quick food. Uh -huh. It was the first uh, McDonald's. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. When we went in and I said, uh, she ordered what she wanted. I ordered a Western egg sandwich because they were really good. Mm -hmm. And I knew the guy that made them. <laughs> and I said, now don't put any lettuce on. I said, okay. We were come back and gave it to us, and the lettuce was on, and Stacy said, look, they put lettuce on. I said, God damn it, and I the lettuce out and threw it over the table, and she was flabbergasted. <laughs> 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 but strangely turned on. <laughs> <laughs> she was just strangely aroused. <laughs> I I looked at him and said, why did you do that? I didn't want it. <laughs> after, after she saw that, she was like, let's get married. <laughs> You're my kind of cowboy. <laughs>